And we welcome you back on the Unity Mustang Sports Network for game two of the doubleheader between the Prince between Princeville and Unity. And so we're back here today. We're back here today. But yes, and I just got a word that Chris Dewar is in the house. But he he actually decided to make the trip over, even though he actually can make a trip over here. So yeah, happy to have Chris here tonight. So yeah, we're back to play and Game two pitch will be Miles Moulton, and also we got a little change into our little lineup here. So, from so um, Simon Rabia will now play left field, and Carter Reeves will catch this game, as I've been told by Coach McAllister. And <clears throat> and so uh, we will get set here for game two. As, uh, we'll get set here, and uh, layoff man uh, Jet Benningfield will lead off here for Princeville. And there's a called strike there. Good start to the game here. With a, with a strike there. This is Benny Fields first that bad with an average. There's a ball <clears throat> inside for ball one. Maintains averages zero zero right now. So as I'm looking right now, as a, there's a second pitch swan, third pitch swan a miss, or a strike two and one and two the count. Well, he has one RBI at. Only has one RBI, but yeah, that's the thing here. We get we get started to see a little now. That pitch is a little inside there. And here's the pitch, off the plate, three and two. Sorry if I don't. I'm not talking that much. I think my voice already been <laughs> gone after the last game. Well, I'm still battling through it. I'm going to keep talking and lose it all the way through. But a uh, 3-2 pitch is a little ground ball to the third baseman, Sawyer Allen. He steps and throw on the first and makes the first out right there. Five three on that ground ball. And we'll... Noah Geiker will, be, will come out to bat here. Batting 250 on the season so far. He's got one hit on the season as well. Two, 250 on base percentage as he takes a strike there. <coughs> then a 250 on base percentage as well as for Benningfield as well. I forgot to read that. There's a swing and a miss right there for strike two. Bolton in the windup. And the pitch. Swing a miss. <coughs> there's, a, there's a strikeout there. And first strikeout of the game for Miles Bolton. There's out number two. Now Logan Alshowski will step up to the plate. He comes in batting two. I mean, not to uh, six, six, 67 right there as he swings and misses in the dirt. Two hits on the season. 667 on base percentage. There's a liner, little shallow floater in the center. And oh, in and out of the glove with Freeze. We're gonna, we're, it's going to go as a hit, but good, good effort there by... By Avery Freeze is Alshowski is aboard with a with a hit. We're gonna, goes off the glove, goes off the glove of Freeze by a good effort though. But it's gonna go as a hit. But but yeah, 
Colin Lowry will step up in now as he comes in batting two, all right, six, 67 as well. I think they said a ball outside. He's also scored in a run as well and hit with two hits on the season and one double. And a low ground ball to the shortstop Schaefer. He'll step and throw on the first and plenty of time to get the the batter Lowry as the Prince leave a runner on on one hit. No errors. We head to the bottom of the first with your score. Still zero zero. And Avery Freeze will be off the bottom first here for the Mustangs as the Prince uh, will play defense here as a pitch high up and in a freeze for ball one. Now swing a miss there by Avery Freeze. One one the count. Today's starting pitcher for the Prince is ball a little outside, but look good here. But okay, is a Dick is a Parker Dickinson. He comes in with a seven hundred with seven point zero zero ERA. He's got one loss on the season. There's a foul tip into the catcher's mitt there for strike two. <coughs> you now a swing and a miss by Freeze. There's out number one. Looks like, looks like Freeze pulled a little head over there a little bit, but there's out number one as uh, Miles Moulton, the pitcher, will step up to the plate here. And first pitch, looking for a strike. And a one swung and missed for strike two. And now the 0 2 pitch from Dickinson is a swing and a miss. And there's a strikeout number two for Parker Dickinson as Miles Mullen goes down swinging. And now in steps Cody Schaefer to shortstop. <coughs> Cody Schaefer played pretty well last last game. As he as he uh, came with with a hit in the seventh inning in the last game, and then out through then as he takes a pitch for a ball, ball one. Now here's a one zero. Little out. Pretty pretty tight zone here so far. In this game right now, as uh, here's the 2-0 pitch, Schaefer ground ball to the third baseman, 
That is a good throw to first, and he is, he's, I guess his foot still stayed on the bag there. We're going to get a play by the third baseman, Alshazki. And that will be the end of the inning as the Mustangs go 1-2-3 here. With a second, we just score still 0-0. Zero, zero. Welcome back on the Unity Mustang Sports Network. Is um, we got the leadoff man. This is Hunter Johnson. Oh, we know. I know Trenton. Buff Buffum, Buffum will pop up there to the freeze if if I'm right. Yo, no, Schaefer. Excuse me. Mixed up my mixing up the players here already. So I'll be a. Uh, Now this is Hunter Johnson here. Let's uh, get back on the stat here. Johnson comes in, batting, if I can find it. And the first pitch is in there for a ball. It doesn't say Johnson's average on here, so. Oh, wait, no, yeah, it does. Yes, Johnson just had got out on the schedule, folks. I'm trying to find his little stat here, and it's not even on here, but we got a 2-0 count, and there's the pitch. It's in their first strike. <clears throat> and now the 2-1 pitch to... Uh, Taken for strike two is it's a two two count to Hunter Johnson. And Mullen gets his sign. He comes from a wind up the two two pitch. Foul back. Now here's another 2-2 pitch. It's lined foul down off over by the 
Gunsville dugout. And now another 2 2 pitch. It's in the dirt for ball three, three and two. Now, the time it's called. <coughs> And Mullen comes on to wind up the 3 2 pitch. It's ball four. Johnson's aboard. What a walk. Buffum got that out with one. Now Johnson walks, and there's a run on first with two, with one out. And now. Carter Peterson, the designated hitter, will bat here. Walton checks the run first, and then comes set. Deals. A little taking for a ball, a little inside. And now the 1-0. Inside. Two of the count to Carter Peterson, the left handed batter. Two O pitched from Moulton. Three and O. There's a there's a strike call. Peterson DH for his second baseman Brody Day to this evening, so we'll keep him alert in case Mr. Day gets in the game or not. So here's a swing foul tip. And a, <laughs> it was a very high pitch and Peterson swings at it. And the count is full three and two. Now the 3-2 pitch for Miles Moore as he steps off. Moore sets. Deals the 3-2 pitch. Foul back and out of play. Still 3-2. Pearson comes bang one. With a one with a one point zero zero adding average, one hit. The three two foul back again. Oh no! Oh no! Down the left field line, fair. And a throw to third, and they and and now that they say. That he is safe. He's in there safely. Good, pretty good attack. Good tag and throw by, well, the throw came from Simon Ray, but a good tag by Sawyer Allen, but good effort. But they say he's in there safely. <coughs> and it'll be a jump, and it'll be a double for Peterson. Actually, it'll go as a single, excuse me. But he advances on the play at th on the throw. And here's the pitch. Good 
And Parker Dickinson Dickinson is up here. And a pitch. I say a ball. It's a ball there. <coughs> it's a two two pitch. Rio the count to Parker Dickinson. A uh, little fly ball in the right center. It will get down for a hit. Uh, throw in, because cut off as a run comes in to score on a RBI single by Parker Dickinson. Now runners at the corners with one out. And Matthew Bauer Bowers is at the plate to catch her. Ball comes set and deals. And it's fouled back and out of play. It's a sign. He comes set. The 1 0. <coughs> now, stolen base for Dickinson. I just. Now, a 1 1 pitch from Moulton. Two one, two one. The count. Bow. The two one pitch to Bowers. Three and one. In the pitch. Taking for strike two, and the count's full three and two. <coughs> uh, three two pitch. Ground ball to the one. The goal one. Now, uh, this little running in here, a little, a little ground ball. Ground ball there will be a one three on that. So now we're back to the top of the order with Jet Benningfield, who grounded out in the, in the first inning. He swings and misses. All one that count. Mullen gets his sign. He deals. And it's high for a ball. Ball one. And now the one 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 pitch from Miles Moulton on its way. And there for strike two. 
One, two, one, two, the count. Two gone. Runners on second and third with two outs. From the stretch, deals. Swing and a miss. The Mustangs get out of the jam there. But the Princes get a, get a run there on an RBI single by Park. Oh, wait, two. Yeah, an RBI single by Connor Peterson. But they leave two runners on there. We head to the we head to the bottom of the second. We are scored one nothing, Princeville. Welcome back on the Uni Mustang Sports Network as Simon Raby will lead off as he leads off as he takes a pitch for a ball for ball one. Dickinson from the wind up the pitch. Little out little outside for ball two, two and out. Oh. Now the two oh pitch from Dickinson to Raby and Raby grounds it down the first baseline foul. A foul as it'll be two and one. Now the two one pitch. Ruby swings and misses. Two two the count to Simon Raby. The 2-2 two -two pitch outside for ball three. Now the 3-2 pitch, swing and a miss. Third strikeout on the night for Dickinson. Now in steps Ben McClellan, who came up big in the last game in the seventh inning, which went into extra innings. But you know, let's see what he can do here in this game as he takes a strike for strike one. And he takes a pitch low in the dirt for ball one. Now here's the 1-1 one, one pitch. And now and now 1-2 one, pitch. 1-2 one, one, the count is Now Dick, Parker Dickinson from the wind up the 1-2 pitch. And low in the low for ball 2. Two and two. The two two pitch. Two 
Two to the count. Still to Ben McClellan. Parker Dickinson from the windup again. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Now, Sawyer Allen will step up here. First pitch to Allen. Take it for a strike. Now the 0-1, swing and a miss. Now the 0-2 pitch. Foul back. Still 0-2 on Sawyer Allen. Now, Dickinson from the windup, the pitch. Ground ball to the second baseman. Bottles it a bit, but stays with it. And that's a play by Brody Day there, and that will end the inning. We head to the third. Your score, one nothing, Princeville over Unity. Welcome back on the Unity Mustang Sports Network. And the first pitch is taken for, for a ball. At least start at the top of the third inning. Geiger with the pitch. Taking a little inside, inside for ball two. Now the 2-0 pitch. In the dirt. 3 0 the count. And in the first pitch says inside ball four. Now here's uh, Logan 
Olszowski and the ball throw down to second, not in time. It'll be a stolen base. And they say it came out the back. I wonder what happened there. I guess they say it came out the back. No, he got the count there. Oh, well. Caught stealing his Geiger. Here's a 0 1. Take it for a ball. For ball one. Taken for a ball. Ball two, two and one. Two and one, they count. We got one gone here in the top of the third inning. Won't sets and deals. Off the play as he goes off the glove of Carter Reeves. Three one the count to Alshaski. Now swing a miss for strike two, three and two. Three two the count. Molt sets. Deals. Swing and a miss. And there's the second out of the inning here. No, that's, that's Colin Lowry who grounded out in the first inning. He's 0 for 1. And the first pitch on its way is in the dirt for ball 1. Now, Swan foul back for strike two, for strike one, excuse me. Got to make sure I'm keeping track of my pitches here, folks. That's for sure. <laughs> you know, my pitch count. <laughs> but thank God I got a scorebook for a reason. And here's a 1-1 one -one pitch. Popped up. Calling for it is Moulton. And that will end the inning. Oh, a fly to one, and that will do it here as the Mustangs gallivanting here. And we head to the bottom of the third. Your score still one nothing, Princeville over Unity. And welcome back on the Uni Mustang Sports Network. Skyler Gottschall leads things off here for the Mustangs, and he swings and misses for strike one. Now Dickinson from the windup, he deals in the dirt.
And a 1 1 count to Gottschall. And the 1 1 pitch. Off the plate, ball two. 2 and 1. And now the 2 1 pitch. Got 2 2 the count. Dickinson from the windup gets a sign. The 2 2 pitch. Ball three, full count now, three and two. Once again, if any of you guys are knowing the score on the eighth grade state tournament game right now, if you would like, to, if you wouldn't mind putting that in the comments, that way, that way I can update everyone on what that score is. I would appreciate that. But whatever that, no, no need to worry about it. I'm not too worried. But as there's a walk to Godshaw. No one steps. Carter Reeves. And Reeves bunts. Pulls back. There's ball one to Carter Reeves. It's first that bad of the season. Dickinson sets, deals, pulls back, and there's a stolen base. There's a stolen base there for on a what we got a wild pitch, fastball there as all right. PB on that one. It'll be. Two over oh, the count and two oh is a ground ball at the middle. And uh ooh, look good as good as a, it'll be a, be a six three on that ground out there. And uh, there's a ball taken there for Elijah Parsons as I back to play here. We got a 1-0. Take first strike one. And now a 1-1 is the count as Parker Dickinson gets his sign. comes from the stretch. He deals. Strike two. Now from the stretch again is Dickinson, the pitch. Swing and miss. Now we're back up to the top of the order now with two gone is Avery Freeze, who struck out in the, his first at bat. And from the stretch is Dickinson. Checks the run at second. No, Gacho almost was picked off by their umpire's point. Like, oh, just an inch. Just, just an inch in there. He's safe. From the stretch again, deals. Taking for a ball, ball one. And the 1 0 taken high, ball two. Two so all count here is. Oh, 
Roll in the dirt. Roll two. Or roll three. Excuse me. Losing track. Losing track of my count. We're good. Three all the count to Avery Freeze. And Dickinson sets. 3 0 pitch. Taking for a strike. Now the 3 1 pitch. Ball four. Now runners at first and second now with two gone. Now in sets Miles Moulton. No. Now Dickinson sets. Checks the run at second. Deals. And now Moulton didn't like the strike call. He thought it was low. It was 0 and 1. And a ramble back to the pitcher, Dickinson. He'll step and throw on the first for the third out. As the Mustangs get no runs, no hits, no errors, two left on base. We head to the we head to the top. We head to the top of the third. The score. Uh, we head to the fourth. One one nothing Princeville. Welcome back on the Unity Mustang Sports Network. My bad if I lost track of my little inning there. I've got to put bottom third, but now it's top four, so I got my mistake figured out there. So we're all good here, folks. You know, we're still we're in the top of the fourth inning here as uh, Buffum will lead off. Trent Buffum, the right fielder. And he takes the ball high for ball one. He flied out in his first at bat in the second inning. And a pitch taken for a ball outside for ball two. Two will they count. From the stretches, Moulton, the pitch. Take for a ball high. Three and out. Once again, tomorrow, Mustang fans, I will have tomorrow's game at noon, and here's the pitch. Taking for a strike. Yeah, tomorrow's game is at noon. It's also double hair, but I will not have the second game because it's <laughs> Gerard and Central, and I don't, you know, I very only do our game because that's the important one for me. As there's strike two, and the count is full three and two on Trenton Buffum. 
But yeah, be free to listen tomorrow. Maybe you all can see old Craig Schmish came at the game tomorrow. Old, old Craig. I always got to give him a hard time. I'm sure he'll be there. Trying to watch his Cam Point Central Panthers play. Craig, I'll say this for you, but I know you'll be there, Jim. <laughs> uh, well, here's a 3-2 pitch. Ball four. And now Buffum's aboard. No. Walton's going to have... I haven't thrown that much. He's at, uh, let's see, he's, he's at 63, right? 63 pitches? He's at 63 pitches right now. He's just walked this guy, walked a guy here. Now runner goes. Now all overthrown, but it'll be a stolen base. It'll be a stolen base for Buffum. Is taken for a ball there. So I get that right there. Here we go. And now here's the pitch. And it's taken for a ball. For ball two. Two and out. And now here's a 2 0 pitch. Over. Up, thrown up and in. It's three and out. There's a take pitch taken there for a strike one. It's three and one to Hunter Johnson. And there's a swung on a miss for strike two. Three and two the count. Here's a 3-2 pitch. Popped up. Foul territory. Calling for it. Godshaw. It's the netting. And it's foul ball. Uh, still a 3-2 count to uh, Hunter Johnson. Molten sets. Deals another 3-2. Fouled away. <coughs> now... Now another 3-2 pitch from Miles Moulton on its way. Fouled off again. Good battle at the plate there for Hunter Johnson. one nothing is your score. Princeville over Unity here in the top of the fourth inning. Three two pitch. Lined in a center. It'll get down. And I'll play a third. They say got him. Now the ball gets thrown away. The ball got thrown the runners out of third, and then the ball got overthrown at second to try to get the other runner. That was Johnson. As it'll be a single and then It'll be a four be a four sound at third. Or no, not a four sound, it'll just be a put out. Just a hit and then uh single and then so if it thrown out at third, it'll be uh it'll be a eight five on that. And Johnson's still on the throw. (laughs) 
There's a five of foul back. So Johnson will get a stolen base on that throw, and then now a now a foul back will be an 0-1 count. And now there's a pitch high for ball one. Now Moulton sets the one one pitch. Round ball to short. That's Schaefer. He'll step and throw into first and a scoop. No good. Oh, home. Not in time. So it'll be, uh, it'll be an error there as a run does come in to score. On the error, and the lead is now 2 nothing Princeville. No. Oh, now it's one one only is the count and a pitch. It's a ground ball to shortstop Schaefer again. He'll get the little he'll get the out at second. And now it's a there's choice. Everyone thought it was a everyone thought I got a little confused in there, but it's only two outs. So we'll get fielder's choice there on that one. It will be a 6-4 on that. Now Bowers at the plate with two gone. I'll throw it to first and run her back in safely. The ball is taken for a ball there. And now here comes a 1 0 pitch on its way, and it's taken for a strike. And there's a pitch low in the dirt. It's stopped by Reeves. As there'll be a there'll be a stolen count as stolen base or well it'll be a wild pitch on that. The foul back. Two two is the count. Now the it's just taken high for ball three and it's full three and two. Walton sets the three two pitch. Ball four. Now we got time is called and we'll have a pinch runner. Will be sixty eight. That is Taylor Hess. It's for the catcher Bowers. Now I think we're gonna I'm not sure. I think we're no no pitch change here. So now 
Copy is this thing on top of the Hess. Pinch running. And now we're back to play with the layoff man Jet Benningfield back up to the point. He's over two. Swing a miss. So now won't come set the one. Okay, for strike two. O2 the count. And the pitch. Little floater, floater in the right. Brandon Hoofendick sticks with it, makes a catch. It was at the tip of his glove and it went in. Well, that's the third out. Now I guess they left two on base, right? On that, yeah, yeah, they leave two on. They get a couple run, get a couple runs there. We head to the bottom of the fourth. They scored two nothing, Princeville. All right, Cody, back to play here. I forgot to turn my mic up, but Cody Schaefer just took a hit by the pinch. So we start at the bottom of the fourth story. I forgot to turn my mic on there, but hit by the pitch is Schaefer. Uh, there's a strike taken there to, to Simon Raby, who's 0 for 1. Going to throw it to first. Schaefer back in safely. But, and here's a pitch to Simon Raby. Foul back. Still 0-2. Dickinson. This is signed. He sets. The O. And now time's called by Simon Raby. Now the 
0 2 and it's foul back. Now, here's a note to as Schaefer's back in safely. The order first is Schaefer's back in safely. Dickinson's at Dickinson's already at fifty one pitches in this game. Sixty am I right? Yes, I am. Another O two pitch to Simon Raby. Not sure what era. I heard a bunch of noise coming to my left in the Mustang dugout. I'm not sure what they were saying. I heard a bunch of noise going on, but maybe he takes a pitch way inside. And it's one and two. There's a one two. Maybe he fouls it off again. Still a one two count. Now here comes as Dickinson sets. Waves it off the sign, checks the runner first. Here comes set. Throw those over to first. Schaefer gets back in safely. No, oh, one two pitch. Low in the dirt for ball two, two and two. And it's taken for a ball high, and it's full three and two to, for Simon Raby. Ben McClellan's on deck. No outs, two nothing Princeville, and the three two pitch to Simon Raby. Lines a foul down the right field line. Good cut by Raby there. Now the right field line that gets out of play. Good at bat, good at bat right now for Raby is he's continuing to battle at, at the plate. Still a three two count. Dickinson comes set. And another 3-2 pitch. Baby grounds a foul off to the left and out of play as it bounces over the Mustang dugout. And now a 3-2 pitch again. And now they said now a call strike three. Simon McAllister is giving his explanation. He's telling he's telling our home play umpire to hit the ground his glove hit the ground, but it's a call strike three and, and there's one out. Uh, now, shit, now ball gets away on a little, it'll be an error. Schaefer rounds and looks, and it'll be, he'll hold up at second after that little throwing error there. On, it'll be an E1 on that as Schaefer advances.
Um, and McClellan will take a strike there. 1-1 one, one count. Say if pitch is inside for ball two. Yeah. Two one the count. The pitch. High Now a 3-1 pitch from Dickinson to McClellan. It is a call, call strike. 3-2. and two. <clears throat> One out here on the bottom of the fourth inning, the pitch. It's going to be in play in foul territory. It'll be a foul ball. Ball dropped out of the, off the glove as, of Dickinson, the pitcher. Now another 3-2 pitch. And they say strike three. And that's, and that's out number two. Now Sawyer Allen will step in with two gone. He rounded out back in the second inning. He takes a strike. All one is the count. Dickinson getting his sign. Now he sets. Checks the runner at third is Schaefer and hidden deals. Swing and miss by Allen. Now swing and a miss. Allen strikes out. Mustangs leave a runner on. We head to the fifth. Your score is still 2 nothing, Princeville over Unity.
Sorry, sorry, I bring my mic turned off. I don't know what what the, in the world happened there, but there's two. There's two gone here. Runner on third. There's a strike call there. My apologies to everybody. I'm not sure if I hit the hit a button or I tapped it with my finger. I'm not sure what I did. But yeah, the mic's back on. <laughs> And the pitch, and it's a line to the right. He'll get down for a base hit. And it'll uh, be an RBI single, and the lead is now 3 nothing Princeville. Buffum will come through there. And I'll get my score change here as Hunter Johnson comes out to the plate as he takes the ball there for ball one. There's a strike call there. One one is the count, if I'm correct. Yes. Now a uh, one one pitch from Raby. Strike two. One two is the count on Hunter Johnson. And now uh, Raby comes from the stretch, checks on it first. One two pitch. And they call strike three. Mustangs get out of the jam there. As uh, Princeville leaves the runner on, they get a get a run in on an RBI single by Trenton Buffum, and we head to the bottom of the fifth. We are score three nothing Princeville. Skyler got you all late things off here to start the bottom of the fifth inning. Mustangs trail 3 nothing. As there's a pitch taken there for a strike to Gottschall. And there's a 0-1. Right 2. And now here's a 0-2 pitch to Gottschall. One two is the count. And here's a one two pitch. Swing a miss. And now in steps. Carter Reeves, one out. Reeves grounded out in the first and in the third, excuse me, as he takes strike one there. Said so strike two there. And 
and now an O2 to this account to Reeves. Now swing a miss. And now there's a no strike out there for Dickinson. There's two gone with Elijah Parsons at the plate. There we go, cut by Elijah Parsons. He just fouls off the first pitch. All one to count. Parker Dickinson still out on the mound for the Princes. And takes a pitch low there for ball one. Now, uh, here's a 1-1 one, one pitch from Dickinson to Parsons. All right, two. One, two is the, is the count now. Now, we'll get out of play. Count will stay one and two. There's a now here's a one two. Oh check Swain. Ground ball is short. Harsons beats it out. Harsons beats it out. Man, infield single for Elijah Parsons. Now in steps Avery Freeze, who is 0 for 1 today and was left on base and walked. Takes a pitch low in the dirt. No. Ball two there. Two zero is the count to freeze, and the two zero pitch, swing and miss. And now it's two and one. Uh, throw it first. Parsons back in safely. Two gone with the runner on first and freeze at the plate. Parker Dickinson sets and deals. And then uh, they said they said strike all. Now Freeze fouls back. Still two and two. And here's a two two. Freeze. Takes ball three, three and two. There's ball four. Now Miles Moulton is aboard with runners on first and second. <laughs> and here's the first pitch to Miles Moulton on its way. 
popped up and it will get out of play. Bottom five scores three nothing. Princeville over Unity is a uh, one pitch to Moulton outside. Ball one on the count is one and one. The one one pitch in the dirt. One, two, the count. Uh, wait, two, one, excuse me. Now it's two, two. Excuse me. Excuse me. Two, two is the count. Dickinson sets, checks the runner at second, deals a two, two pitch. All in the dirt. Now a 3-2 pitch as, a, as Dickinson steps off. Now a 3-2 pitch to Miles Bolton, ball four. Now bases are loaded now for Cody Schaefer with two gone. We got time scholars, we'll go for a mound visit here. All right, two walks in this inning and a hit. As uh, we'll, have, we'll have a pitching change here. We'll tell you about the new pitcher when we come back after the break. Don't go away. Coley Palmer is the new pitcher as the first pitch taken for a strike to Cody Schaefer. Palmer comes in with the comes in as Schaefer pops it up in foul territory and he'll get out of play and the count is 0-2. Ball 
Palmer's first game in is pitching, it says on here, so we're good there. 0-2 the count to Cody Schaefer. There's a liner to right, and it will get down. One run will score. Here comes another. Schaefer on his way to third. And three run score. That's a three run triple for Cody Schaefer. And we got a tie ball game here, Jim. We got a tie ball game here. We got a tie ball game here. Cody Schaefer delivers. Holy cow. Cody Schaefer comes through. Oh my gosh, what a swing. I'm counting that as a triple there, I don't, no matter what. Holy cow. And the first pitch is taken for a ball right for Simon Raby. And there's ball two. And now here's a pitch to Simon Raby to left field and caught. But the Mustangs can tie the game up on an RBI two or three run triple by Cody Shaver to cut this game. And it's tied 3-3 as we get to the top of the six. Your score tied 3-3. We got a ball game here in Jacksonville, Jim. Don't worry. <laughs> Welcome back on the Uni Mustang Sports Network. Cody Schaefer ties the ball game up as we start the top of the sixth inning. And there's a call strike there. And it uh, looks like we got a, is that a pinch hitter or same guy? Oh, no, same guy. This is Peterson. A called strike. Sorry, Mr. Carter. There's a ball taken outside for a ball. Once again, Mustangs leave a runner on after a little RBI two three run triple, excuse me. By Cody Schaefer to tie the ball game up here at three, and there's ball two, two and one. There's a call strike two. Yeah, their pitch is foul tipped. Count still two and two. Yeah. 
And Raby deals a 2-2. Call strike three on the outside corner. Uh, and there's one gone. Now, in steps in the pinch hitter for uh, Mr. Uh, Parker Dickinson is Coley Palmer, and he fouls it off. Strike one there. That's strike two. As I lost track of my count here, folks, it's 0 and 2. I keep writing in the wrong area on my sheet here. 0 2 pitch from Raby. Call strike three. And Simon Raby's getting it going now. He's already got, I think he's got, let's see. One, two, nine batters, nine balls. I think that's his third, right? I think that's his third one on the night. I think I count that right. If I'm correct. As uh, we, uh, the ball high to Bowers. A swing of miss in the dirt. I guess we got two strikes. Excuse me, I didn't know. He, I didn't know the guy called it a strike. My bad, to everybody. That's offline for me. And it calls strike three. Simon Raby strikes out the side, and we head to the bottom of the sixth inning with a good ball game here in Jacksonville right now. We got it's tied three three. We're back after this. Ben McClellan will lay things off for the Mustangs as he swings and misses at the first pitch. Four strike one. Tie ball game here. Just shaking outside for a ball. McClellan's 0 for 2 on the day. Take her ball two. Two and one. There's a ball three. Three and one. Now a 3-1 pitch. Takes a strike. Now a 3-2 pitch on its way. Foul back. So a 3-2 count.
Uh, another three two and a ball it'll be ball four. And and now Sawyer Allen will come up to bat here as it's as there's no outs and a runner on first. He has ground Allen has grounded out and struck out in this game. Well taken low there for ball one. Now, now, as the first says, run was back in safely there, and here's a 1 0 pitch. Now it takes it inside. Ball two. Allen takes another one inside, ball three, three and oh. And a call strike there. And Allen takes one for the team there as he's hit by the pitch. Now we got time called here. I think we'll have, I think we'll have a pitching change here. I'm not sure yet. We'll wait and see as there's a mound visit here by Princeville. So head coach comes out to the mound to talk to his pitchers and guys on the infield. Once again, the crowd's still about the same here. Well, St. Crowd's all right. A little small one over on the Princeville side to my right. Some of the Lady Mustangs made the trip tonight, including Brady Mugi actually made the drive over, I guess. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, appreciate the other athletes making the drive over. Yeah, just making the drive over to watch the boys compete in a little doubleheader here in Jacksonville. Now, still same pitcher here as I just got told, so we're back to play now with Skylar Godshaw at the plate. Uh, Bond attempt there by Godshaw. Though the first, get, they get the, they get, and the, Gonshaw will be a, be a, be a sack, will be a sack butt there. Both the runners will advance McClellan and Allen. I'll get a sack butt on that and a 1-3 if I will make that correctly. The ball gets away. Now a runner, run will come in and score, and he is saved! What a job, Red Dunn! Oh, excellent ball got away from the pitcher. That was Palmer. It'll be a wild pitch, and, and a score there. I'll write that down there. It'll be a ball there for Reeves. I'll put wild pitch in. In one of the boxes right now. There we go. I fixed it there. Now, uh, base. Now, liner in the left. He'll get down for a base hit. Mustangs take a five-three lead on a wild pitch and an RBI single by Carter Reeves. A one-out rally going here now. And now, instead, Elijah Parsons.
Now Blake Arnsman will come in and be a courtesy runner for Carter Reeves. Yeah, Mustangs are on a roll now. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, fellas. And, uh, uh, Parsons trying to, well, I guess we're waiting on our courtesy runner here. And now I'll write, it, write that down real quick. Arns, Arns will be our courtesy runner here. There we go. I wrote that down. And now we're back to play a thrower to first. Arns been back in just safely. Uh, And now a, pit, a pitch. And the count is 1 0 on 1 0 on Parsons. And now Arnson's back in safely. And here's a pitch. Here for strike two. Or strike one, excuse me. One one the counts of Elijah Parsons. And they strike two there. One point after I didn't really point his arm point his arm hand out. And uh but there's strike three is Parsons goes down, Lucan. There's two gone here with the runner on first. Now, ball gets away. It'll be a wild pitch as Armsman goes to second. Avery Freeze will, will take a ball there as. I'll fix that there real quick on Arnsman's bit. Now another pass, another pass ball there. First a wild pitch and then a pass ball. Uh, three zero count now to freeze. Now a three zero pitch to Avery Freeze. Fouls it back. Freeze takes strike two. Got a full count, three and two. And Freeze gets jammed on that one. It'll be a foul ball. It'll be a foul ball, though. That's a little. As Freeze continues to battle at the plate. Now here's another 3-2 and ball four. Now time is called here. Now we got a pitching change here. And we'll tell you all about it when we come back after this a little timeout. 5 3 uni Unity over Princeville.
And now we're back to play. We got a pitching change at 68. Haylor Huss into the game to pitch as uh, as there's ball one taken there for Miles Moult. Runner on first and third with two outs. The pitch. See, see, pitch is up. Taking for ball two. Once again, I appreciate everyone who's listening in tonight to the broadcast. And here's a 2-1. Swain and a miss as Moulton pulls his head there as he swung, but it was a 2-2. Two and two. And a 2-2 two -two pitch to Miles Moulton. Takes a breaking ball and it's popped up in a shallow foul territory and it's foul. Count still two and two. And a swing and a miss as that will end the inning. Mustangs get a couple runs on a on some hits there as we leave a got we leave a couple on. We head to the seventh. We score five three unity over Princeville. Welcome back on the Uni Mustang Sports Network. As we start the seventh inning here, and pitch overthrown by pitch overthrown there by yeah. But as I fix my scoreboard here, as it's top of the order here, it's you know, it's a 2-0 count here now for Jet Benningfield. Once again, thanks to the media for all their local coverage of local teams. Chris Stewart showed up tonight, earlier tonight. Appreciate him. Appreciate him coming out here. Once again, very free to tune in at 10 o'clock tonight for WGM Sports at 10 and QHA Sports Final as well. And that'll be a we got a 3-1 count. Yeah, we do. Now here comes a 3-1. Swing a miss. Full 3-2. and two. Now a 
to a swan and miss. Good pitch there by Simon Raby. He gets a strike out there, and there's one gone. Noah Geiger will Noah Geiger will step up here. He struck out and walked twice and got and was caught stealing in the third. He takes a pitch high for a ball. Simon throws a strike there for strike one, and the count is one and one. Two and one the count now as there's a ball there. And here comes the pitch. All right, two. Two to the count to Geiger. The two two. Call oh, strike three on the outside corner. And there's two gone. Now in staff slogan. Oshowski. There's a swing of mess there for strike for, for strike one. Cal moves to one and one. Raby gets his sign and he deals. Three one the count now is three three one is the count. Take it for strike two and the count is full three and two. Uh, a little dribbler down the third base line foul. Still a 3-2 count. Raby deals. Rounder foul. Ball was low. I thought, yeah, I got a ball four here. As we got a runner on with two gone here. Now in steps Colin Lowry. It was over three tonight. Now Tyler McAllister out to talk. The guys. So I got two outs with a runner on first, and Colin Lowry at the at the plate. There's strike one to Lowry. 
Maybe regroup in here. Two gone and a runner on first and a 0 1 pitch. On the dirt. Under Reese. We'll get a fastball there. <clears throat> one one the pitch. Foul back. Once again, the Princes are down to their final strike. Can Raby get the save here? One two the count. Runner on second. The pitch. And the dirt. Two and two. Two two count. Raby gets his sign. He sets. Checks the run second. The two two pitch. Foul back. Still a two two count. And now another two two pitch inside. Three to the count. The pitch. Call strike three. That will end this game. Simon Raby gets the save. And the Mustangs will get the game two win. Over Princeville, five to three, the final. As Simon Raby gets the save there. And that will just wrap things up here as well from Jacksonville. As the Mustangs move to one and one on this to start out the season. And that will just wrap it up here. Once again, join me tomorrow afternoon at 12 o'clock for the 12 o'clock for 12 o'clock start. And really join me for tomorrow's game at 12 o'clock on the Uni Mustang Sports Network. From Hunt both myself, the voice of the Mustang saying saying so long from Jacksonville, Illinois.